Welcome back friends to my channel Missile Vault where we talk about India's strength, its defense power and the future of missile technology. Today, we are going to talk about one of India's most advanced and powerful strategic missiles, the 2026 K6 missile. This missile represents the third and most dangerous leg of India's nuclear triad, symbolizing the country's sea-based strategic nuclear capability. The K-6 missile is being developed by DRDO, the Defense Research and Development Organization, and it will be deployed on India's nuclear-powered submarines in the future. Before this, India had the K-15 Sagarika and K-4 missiles, but the K-6 is far more powerful, has a longer range, and is technologically more advanced than both of them. The most important feature of the K-6 missile is its range. Reports suggest that it could reach up to 6,000 kilometers. This means that if launched from an Indian submarine somewhere in the Indian Ocean, it can strike targets across Asia, Africa, and even parts of Europe. This gives India a true second strike capability, meaning that even if any country attacks India with nuclear weapons, India can respond with a powerful counter-strike from beneath the ocean, thousands of kilometers away. The K-6 missile is approximately 12 meters long and weighs around 40 tons. It is a three-stage solid-fuel rocket, which gives it stable and precise flight over long distances. It can carry a nuclear payload of 2 to 3 tons and uses multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicle MIRV technology. That means it can hit multiple targets in different locations with a single launch. The K-6 is specifically designed for the next-generation Indian nuclear submarines, the advanced versions of the Arihant class. It is believed that in Zarighat and the upcoming S-5 class submarines will be equipped with this missile. Once deployed, India's deterrence capability will increase several times over. Now let's talk about its strategic importance. The K-6 is not just a missile, it is a symbol of India's defense policy and its commitment to maintaining peace through strength. It ensures that India will always have the ability to respond to any nuclear threat. That's why it's often called the Silent Guard, because it protects the nation quietly from the depths of the ocean. The guidance system of the K-6 is also highly advanced. It combines an inertial navigation system with satellite-based navigation for extreme accuracy. Its circular error probable CEP is said to be very low, meaning it strikes very close to the target point with precision. By 2026, the missile is expected to complete its test trials. If everything goes according to plan, India will join the elite group of nations that possess long-range, sea-launched ballistic missiles. Currently, only a few countries such as the United States, Russia, China, and France have such capabilities. Friends, the K-6 missile represents India's growing self-reliance and technological excellence in defense. It proves that India is not just protecting its borders but is also contributing to peace and stability across the entire Indo-Pacific region. So friends, if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel Missile World to stay updated with every new missile, defense technology, and future military upgrade of India. Jaya Hind, Vande Mataram.